In this video you'll find out how you can change design of my game with your ideas, how you can make a game like a Dark Souls and what will be direction of this channel. As I promised I'm giving away keys for my latest course. If you want to be a next winner just leave any comments under this video and be sure I'll choose couple of them. My name is Alex, I'm making games and I'm posting videos about it, subscribe if you didn't. And before we begin, I want to give you a sneak peek on a project we're making on the side. It will be a top-down survival with a procedural generation, but graphics are not ready yet. My man starts doing great job, but it takes time. So while he's busy with that, let's make this cool game together. When I say together, I mean people who write comments below. In fact, this game alone was born from a single comment, and I really like that engagement between us. So now let's analyze together what direction are we going to, and then you can give me your ideas and feedback on how we should proceed with this game. We need the reference and what we make in here looks a lot like Hollow Knight that sells Blade Assault and Moonscars. I honestly never played Hollow Knight so that goes away. That sells is good, but I don't have as many weapons with different animations so that goes away as well. I think Moonscars suits the best because it doesn't have lots of animations and yet combat is good and engaging. Characters are somewhat similar and what's most important, people actually requested a Souls-like game. We can take weapon system from Blade Assault but we We'll talk about that later. For now, let's talk about hook of the game, what will make it so special. Sure we can make enemies, levels and souls counter, but we need a hook, something engaging and interesting to make. And I thought of something. What if this girl won't be just a knight, but also a mage with time controlling abilities? Bullet time, rewind, slow motion, whatever comes to your mind. I even tested if I can stop time for a certain enemy and original reaction was priceless. My head just exploded with ideas of what we can do with this. And this, my dear friend, where you step in. Give me your ideas on time shifting abilities or any other abilities for this character. Let's see if we can fit them in the game. Also, I wanna show you changes I did to this project and if you like the video, please press the like button below, it really helps to grow the channel. So, I was busy reworking my first course, currently making it more efficient and easier to understand, but still I found some time to work on this game. I switched from one script to state machine. To explain briefly, it makes it more scalable. Usually, and especially if you are new in Unity, you make in player controller with one script. And that is completely fine, you can make it work perfectly. But if you need to extend it into something bigger with combo attacks and skills, it may be a trouble. So new system is scalable and it's easy to understand. I also want to share a few bug fixes. First, this sword prediction wasn't precise, and I fixed that. Second, rotation wasn't all always right, so I fixed that as well. And that's it. I'm sorry. No, I really did a lot of work here, I swear. It may look the same, but with a state machine inside out it is different. Also I changed cost effect and now I cannot choose between two options. Let me know what's better, option A or option B. And make sure to give me your ideas on the game design and especially skill mechanics. You can do that in the comments below. Thank you for watching video till this moment. Check out the courses if you want to make your own video game. Join the community by subscribing to the channel and remember. We don't play games, we make them.